All right, guys, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna show a couple sets and a couple of our favorite moves that we use consistently in tournaments and uh, throughout our role. So all four of us are gonna show the moves and the sets that we use, and then we're gonna post them to our team page and to the, the YouTube page, and we're gonna get uh, kind of a survey, and we wanna see what you guys wanna see. So we can tape anything. We can go over curriculum stuff, uh, belt stuff, promotional stuff. We can go over finishes, escapes. Um, so as you guys uh, start to give us some feedback, we'll come in, we'll tape the content, we'll post it on the team page, and uh, you guys will hopefully get the most out of this situation that we're all dealing with right now, um, and we'll make it the best we can. So first things first is I'm gonna show you uh, one of my favorite triangle setups. I'm gonna go through a full cross choke series, and then uh, I'm gonna hand it over to Max, and then he'll do his series. So my favorite triangle setups here, I, uh, I got a standing ovation at the uh, grand opening of Matt's Academy of this, so we're here. All right, so let's break it down, all right? I use this um, when a person's stalling, right? So if we're in a tournament and the person isn't really letting me work, they're trying to lock me down and I don't have much to work with, um, I found you need about 30 seconds to finish this top to bottom, okay? I'm gonna just do a little hip switch. Here, I start feeding the lapel. I take the lapel out, I'm gonna make it like a rope, and I'm gonna pass it to the top foot. Here. Now I extend up, that's going to bring Max's arm out. Here. I can take this hand and force it through, or usually if you look at my foot, I can kind of control where his arm goes. Here. Pull. Underhook so this hand can't help him. Clamp. I also have this here. Okay. One more time. I'm here, so he's stalling. I can't move. Whatever side his face is, is facing is the easier side. If his head is neutral, I'll force his head to his side. Here, open that lapel, take your time, all right? Foot comes in, I go up and back, here. Scoop underneath this arm, lock that down, okay? Now, I'm gonna go over a full cross choke series from guard, all right? So, this is your entire cross choke series from the bottom position and everything you guys need to know top to bottom, all right? So I'm in, here, kicking clamp, here, open your feet, So on that one, Max dropped his chin. I use my hand as a crowbar up. It allows me to get inside and do that attack, all right? Here, foot goes on the hip. I kick and clamp, he grabs his hand. I grab his sleeve, punch this down as I pull with the tap here. We go for the choke, he pushes with the other hand now. Here, nice and tight, all right? And I can facilitate this choke with the leg too. So if I come here, I go nice and high with this leg. As I come down, if I lift my wrist up, here. If you notice I'm still on my side, if I square my hips off at the same time, it makes it a little easier. Okay, so I'm flat on the floor. Twist my body. Okay. Last one here is I open and Max goes to the fence. When I go here, now I can't get the choke, but if I take my elbow over Max's elbow, and I use this to push down, I can usually still get it. If not, hand comes free, I'm climbing up the back. Okay, one more time, and I'll hand it over to Max. Open your feet, here. Elbow comes down, hand comes out, scoot away, taking the back. 